Hey guys, welcome to day 15 of my 30 day Spartan Fit Challenge. Today's workout is called the Sandman. Um, and it does require a sand bag. For the men, it's 70 pounds, and for the women, it's 50 pounds. So I do have my 50 pound sand bag that I picked up from Home Depot for just a few bucks. Um, the details of this workout. Um, it does require a 400 meter stretch. Um, and it, this is a four time workout. So at the 400 meter stretch, you'll be doing 10 sandbag chest throws to help you advance the distance thrown. Um, and then 10 sandbag underhand throws to advance your distance. And then while standing in place, you do 10 sandbag slams and then 30 sit ups. And you continue to do that until you reach the end of the 400 meters. So that shall be interesting considering I can barely lift this 50 pound sandbag, um, but I'm looking forward to giving it a shot. On this uh, Sandman workout, I was in a hurry yesterday and being real lazy and decided to just tape up the corners of the sandbag, the 50 pound sandbag that I showed you. And after the first throw and it hit the ground, the pop or the top popped and I lost about a half pan of sand. So I had to go back home and my husband helped me make sure this thing was throwable, slammable. It looks a little ghetto. It's just trash bags and duct tape, a ton of it. Um, but at least I can get this workout done, so. the Sandman workout. Apparently it pays to invest in actually good quality stuff. So the minute I get home, I'm going to buy myself an actual sandbag because even through all of that duct tape and everything, it exploded on me. Um, so unfortunately I'm not able to complete this workout. So what I'm going to do is put this 50 pounds in my backpack and just do 30 minutes on the track so that I at least still get somewhat of a workout. Um, and then I'll add in the sit-ups that I was supposed to do during the Sandman workout. So frustrating. So the Sandman workout was a total fail today. And I have to be honest, it was super annoying and incredibly frustrating. Um, I was really short on time, so I was trying to hurry up and get it all done anyway. And just so like the whole situation wasn't ideal and then my sandbag broke and that was really frustrating so I wasn't even able to do the workout but I still got a workout in um kind of going back to one of my previous episodes about you know not needing the perfect conditions to still exercise and move even though I wasn't able to do the program that I wanted to do and I was incredibly annoyed um I still got a quick 30 minute cardio session in not ideal but I still did it and I think this is a really good note for anyone on a program an extended program there are gonna be days like this there are gonna be days where all the parameters in the day just do not go the way that you want them to hope them to whatever you know you're running late you don't have the right clothes the right shoes and you get to the gym and you're just so flustered and my note to that would be just to get a workout in. Maybe it's not the exact workout that you had prescribed for that day. And instead of cutting it short or doing any of that, just go in and do something. Just get a workout in. You'll feel much better for it. Um, as
as opposed to just saying, oh, my day is shot, I'm, I'm not gonna do anything. I, I mean, there are, there are days where you need to do that for sure, um, but I think just sucking it up and doing it, even when everything else feels so wrong and chaotic and frustrating, um, I think that's kind of the best thing to do. Because one day of mishaps in a long-term plan, a long-term program, isn't going to derail you from your goals, from any sort of progress that you've made. It just happens. So I'm like talking to myself, really telling myself that it's okay. Um, because yeah, I'm a little frustrated, but is what it is. Still got my workout in. So I think that's going to do it for today's episode. Um, I am definitely, I did the minute I got home, I ordered a sandbag. Um, from Brute Force, they had this end of summer sale going on. It was a sandbag up to 75 pounds and a kettlebell that went with it up to 75 pounds and I got an awesome deal on it. So I will be doing the Sandman workout as soon as I get that sandbag and posting it and tracking my time. So there's that. But anyway, um, I hope you guys have a great night. Aru.